Who are you? Why are you stalking so Soka chan? Soka? What was her name? Uh party. Saeko. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have uh, our equipment. Sorry. Uh, and here is quest actually. Let's do this quest. I didn't do any side quest for a bit, so why not do this? Oh, I forgot. Oh, she's strong now. Uh, attack, go. Okay, I'm listening to the right track. Uh, do I need Mega Swing? You're gonna get stuck. I got this. Come up. Okay, finish them. Don't get cocky. You woman beater. Oh, that kick was nice. Okay. Let's see. Watch this. Have fun with this. The the enemy is yes. There was five. Magic plus five to a wrong chap. No, not this. Uh, with heart. I kind of want to go uh, to the bar because I think my teammates getting, uh, you know extra stats from or uh, extra buffs for uh, party link or uh, companion link whatever it was so i think i should use it i don't know if it's if, if i will lose uh, it if i don't use it with him oh crap are you I naked looking i feel like i'm getting called over um uh Help you with what? Uh, to tell you the truth, I need to hop a train to Tokyo as soon as possible. Kay. But I don't have any clothes. I know it. You don't have any clothes? Uh, yeah. All I've got are these bubbles. Bubbles? What are you talking about? Here, see for yourself. Oh, fuck. <laughs> mm. Right, well, I'll get your cold. See ya. Yeah, please, please, don't you see? I can't get on a train like get this. Get off me. Yo, back off. You're getting yeah. bubbles everywhere. How did you even end up like that in the first place? The hell are your clothes? Well, earlier today, I was enjoying my time at a soap land, getting nice and sudsy. This new girl, Mika-chan, is just so cute. Uh-huh. Suddenly, while I'm doing the old slip and slide, I get a phone call from my grandfather. He's not really the type to call, so I got curious and answered. You answer, and... Your grandma's passed out, he tells me. Of course, I'm a major grandma's boy, so I immediately start panicking. Is this a grandson All I can of... think about is getting to the hospital, so I shake off Mika-chan and the bouncers and slip through the door, bubbles popping the whole way. Of Nanomia? But with the way I am now, I'll get caught before I even make it to the station. Yeah, no shit. I'm begging you. Can I borrow your clothes? No. Uh, no way. Uh, figures. I wouldn't want to lend my clothes to a bubble man either. Yep. I mean, I will so, end up naked. Uh, can't you just go back to the soap land and get your clothes? Yeah, about that. Apparently, running out the front door naked is pretty frowned upon at such an establishment, so I'm now banned from entering. I tried to go back in and get dressed, but the bouncers tossed me out, so here I am, stuck between a very slippery rock and a hard place. If you won't let me borrow your clothes, can you at least take me to a clothing store? A clothing store? That's right. There's no telling how much longer these bubbles will last. I have to get clothes and hurry to the hospital before I'm hanging out 
for all the world to see. In that case, why don't I just buy you some? There's no time for that. What if something happens to my grandma while you're out shopping? And grandma? if you don't pick out something in my size or my style for that matter, we'll just be wasting even more time. You're seriously thinking about style right now? Look, if you're that worried about it, just go to the store yourself. Believe me, I would. But it's too risky trying to get there without the bubbles falling off. And to top it off, what about all the wet pockets around here? There's a good chance the bubbles will get washed away. Wet pockets? Okay. One puddle, one little splish of water. These bubbles get washed away and I'm arrested on the spot. And then I can kiss both my grandma and my freedom. Goodbye. That's don't be uh, no, uh, escort mission. Arrested right now. Think you can get me over to a clothing store while avoiding any and all water? I'm begging you. Please. Please. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yeah, this will be most annoying escort mission. Uh, I don't have a choice. All right, I'll take you. <gasps> really? You're a lifesaver. You just have to get to the store without getting you wet, right? Yes, please. Oh, uh, my name's Awano, by the way. I'm Kasuga. Let's get you dressed before you get arrested. Okay, uh, gonna move carefully and avoid water at all cost. Oh my god, this will be painful. Where do I need to go, by the way? What's this? Here. Um, let's go slowly. If you run with your bubbles, they will get uh, get carried away with the wind. So better go slowly, so nothing pops. Kya hentai, hentai, hentai san. Okay, don't bump anyone. Look around for suspicious, splattering water ladies, like this one on the right, child actually. Yeah, hentai, call the police! Uh, oh shit, uh, let's sneak behind. Right, we won't turn slowly. Oh shit, of all things, fire truck. Are you kidding me? Okay, that wasn't that bad after all. Cool. Glad we got out, got you here without you um, hanging out. <laughs> Thanks a million, Kasaka-san. Be right back. Okay. Sure. Go ahead. Be right back for what? For my money to pay for your clothes? I'm com. That, that sounds. That sounds not right. Um, not in your current situation. Mm -hmm. Wait. Are they really gonna let him shop like that? They kick him out, and I will need to ask. Yeah, hentai, get out of here! Wait, please, I just need to buy some clothes. Uh, why, why don't I go inside and buy him clothes? Kasuka san, tell her it's all a misunderstanding. <laughs> They're gonna lock me up at this rate and just when we got to start. Lady, this man is a pervert. And he needs to be locked. This shit just doesn't end, does it? Hey. Look, about my friend my friend here. Hmm. 
He's on his way out of the soap land. He's just a pervert. Perfect. It's a long story. Okay, he's just a pervert. It's a bad option. This may be misunderstanding. He's uh, on his way out of soap land. But it's a long story. Maybe just avoiding any explanations. So. He's just on his way back from the soap land. Cut the guy some slack, will ya? Soap land. I don't care where he was or what he was doing, it's no excuse for running around naked. <laughs> In fact, now I'm certain this man's up. Oh my god, I just run. <clears throat> Got me there. Oh. Kasuka san, please don't take her side. Sorry. Uh, uh, sorry. Um, hey. Look, about my friend here. You're just a pervert. There's a reason this dude's naked. Yeah. Is there? Uh -huh. Yeah. His grandma just passed. That's a very weird reason to get naked. He was in the bath when uh, he got a message and couldn't ignore it, so he ran out without thinking. His grandma passed out? Yeah. Yeah. Do him a favor and sell him some clothes, please. He already made enough of a scene. I'm just trying to help uh, this fool get to the hospital to see his grandma. Okay, I understand. In that case, right this way. Hentai! <sighs> Man, say something ridiculous with a serious face and people will buy it. <laughs> Who are you? Kasuga san, I was able to get some clothes. Now escort me to the hospital. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. But now that I think about it, how do you pay for that? Weren't you naked? Oh, I did pay her. A lot. <laughs> Necklace saw me crying while speaking out clothes and let me put it on the tab. Tab? The clothing store? Sounds suspicious. I'm forever your death. And with that, I'm off to see my grand. Okay. Okay, get going. <laughs> Hope his grandma okay. I don't know why I thought there was grandpa and then I thought about the owner of the soap plant. So that was grandma. Hey guys, where have you been? Um, um, wait, what? Why is it still going here? Okay, but we are very close to the main mission, so let's go to the main mission. You know the moment when you buy a used game and it's already, it already has data on there? That's someone's personal history, man. Think about, think about it. Uh, I don't think there's any games right now that have Saves on them, not these games. Here? Hey, somebody help! Huh? Side mission? Just shut up and hand over your wallet! Come on, people. Seeing this shit makes me sick. Hey, don't you punks have anything better to do with your lives? Huh? Who the fuck are you? Oh, perfect timing. You're with parttimehero.com, right? Who? Cool. Parttime hero? Uh, you lost me. It's a sub story. Right in front of main I don't know story. What your problem is, but if you're trying to be a hero, your ass is going down. Oh, damn, I am a hero. One punch. Battle is on. Okay, lady. Punch them. What's this? Boost the Ali attack with bubbly smiles and <laughs> encouraging charm. I think I do this on. Uh... Kya kawaii! Now I have the power to fight them off. Vision. The OP attack. 
Okay, how much of them? Two? Nah. Yeah. Mega swing. Come on now. Okay. Let's go. And you will I die. So Psycho is buffer. That's good. Hell yeah. He's kind of healer. <laughs> She's buffer. I mean, she kind of looks buff. Uh, okay. <laughs> you really kicked ass back there. Thanks, parttimehero.com. Still don't know what this hero thing you're talking about is. What? You mean part-time hero didn't send you? Da -da -da -da. Never fear. Come on, Raider. Hero is here. Huh? So this year's our bad guy, huh? Just look at him. Yep. Got the classic yep. club tells. Money hungry gaze, low life outfit. What is it with that hair? Looks like he set off a bomb in front of his face. Actually, this guy right here, he... Say not another word. For the glory of part-time heroes everywhere, I will vanquish... I will ignore of every tanks. word of reason now put up and... Your dukes. I'm no stranger to fisticuffs. And just barge with my hands to fight. Classic hero. Here we go. Don't get caught. Try this on the side. Wanna fight? Feel this one. Yeah. You're in it now. Of this. Watch this. Huh? Take it back, shot. Oh, he's tough. Check this out. <laughs> I'm up. You're gonna be in a world of hurt. Breaking top. I got this. Uh, name area mid you unleash a spinning throw that breaks a single Stay enemy and does quarter damage to any enemy. Okay, let's check it out. Let's go! Gotcha! Yeah. Oh, okay, that's good. Get away. Right. Boxer blow. Muda, muda, muda. Still got mashing. I think I need to lower the defense a bit. Okay, the bad break. Let's go. You're gonna be in yeah. a world of hurt. Going in. Okay, this job rank up five. Oh, maybe it's about like about job rank. Because I thought that five there is zero next to on Adachi. But there is something to do with heart. Maybe it's not. Maybe I just wait. Bond five, and she got rank up five. Maybe, uh, maybe. I need to check this bond thing. I would because Adachi got five already, and now it's zero. So I, if I lose it, it would be waste. Okay. Yes! Okie dokie. You're no ordinary thug, are you? I'm not a thug at all, man. He's right. This guy here, he rescued me just now. He rescued you? What are you trying to say? Uh, my name is Caped Bushy. I'm a uh, brother of Caped Baldy. Uncaped. No caped. No caped. Bushy. <laughs> so it was all just a big misunderstanding. Sorry about that. I can't do much in the way of an apology, but I'd be happy to treat you to some tea or what have you. You can't make up for anything. You can be bound, mate. Fights just now. 
You know what? You're right. I beg your pardon. Maybe I should introduce myself. I'm the president of Part-Time Hero Incorporated. Please, call me Hero. Fun fact, I named this company both after myself and the concept of a hero. <laughs> so clever, I know. Okay, I'll ask again. What is this Part-Time Hero thing? Uh, <laughs> Parttimehero.com offers a revolutionary service that puts you in touch with a hero, all from the comfort of your smartphone. It puts you in touch with a hero? So it's a pound, That's mate. what we call you when you register. You'll be taking on quests that people in need post. Upon accepting, it's your job to dash onto the scene and save the day. The concept is, well, it's an odd job service anyway. Uh, and it doesn't take much to start. You could choose to find pets or people if you'd rather stay out of trouble. I promise, it's rewarding work. Huh. I gotta ask, though. Why make this service if there are already others like it? What sets you guys apart? Well, what really sets us apart? Well, it's our mission to clean up the town, stopping trouble before it starts. Start with BJ's. So it's like bounty hunting, then? In a way, yes. What you did just now, fighting off those thugs, that was actually a quest and I mean, posted by Japan. Ijincho, as you know, has an exorbitantly high crime rate. That's why I started this thing up. And what do you know? <laughs> it works. Makes sense. Now I know why that guy thought I was all part-time heroed out. Well, that's another thing. The fact that there are still good, honest people like you out there, it reassures me. I'd say you're one of the few real heroes left in the world. Yeah, all I did was punch a guy who was starting to piss me off. Anyway, see ya. Hi. Wait, 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 please, just a minute. What now? Well, if it's not too much to ask, would you be willing to work for me as a part-time hero? No, I am full-time so hero. So you want me as your muscle? That it? Essentially. We've been getting rave reviews, so we always have an influx of new quests. But since true heroes are in short supply, it means we're short-staffed. Okay. The biggest struggle is finding someone capable of actually winning a fight. Since these heroes are rare, a lot of our clients are still in desperate need of help. Castle guy will fall for it. This city is full of crime. People just don't know what's waiting for them out there. Believe me, I want to help as much as I can, but I'm only one man. And that's where I come in, huh? You've got more than what it takes. Above all, you look out for the little guy and let no evil go unpunished. We need people like you at my company and on the streets. You'll receive compensation, of course. It's a job that feels satisfying and pays well. So what do you say? Will you keep this city safe for all of us? Doesn't sound like such a bad gig. Plus, I get paid. Might as well give it a try. All right, sign me up. Not sure how much help I can be, but why the hell not? That's what I like to hear. Okay, then. Let's rescue this city together. Looking forward to it. Oh, and I'm Ichiban Kasuga. Kasuga-san. Got it. Then allow me to fill you in on the details. Your nickname. Okay, part-time hero quest. Completing part-time hero quest will net you rewards such as money and items. Quests will automatically be received depending on the state of your progress. There can be checked. Uh, this can be checked under part-time hero quest in pause menu. Uh, support quests include delivery quests in which you will task with delivering specific items with rescue quests uh, include takedown quests in which you will uh, need to defeat specific enemies for the city upon completing this task report back to the reps at locations such as convenience stores to mark the quest completed uh, however urgent takedowns and delivery quests do not need to be reported to the reps Simply talk to the person you help to mark the quest as completed. Each quest you complete earns you member member points. Completing these points improves uh, Kasuka's member rank, granting him access to special weapons and more rewarding uh, quests. That's cool. Um, 
take on uh, tougher uh, quest to earn more member points at once. That's cool. Weapons for free? I mean for points. Uh, challenge quests involve various missions based on everyday tasks and uh, when they are completed your personality will improve in accordance with each entry. Rewards for a challenge quest completed before meeting a hero will be automatically added. Cool. And that's about it. Now get out there and save the day, hero. Right on. I like where this is going. Could always use some extra cash. And it's nice being called a hero. Okay. So that's it. Good. Good to have some side missions. I mean, uh, getting cans, collecting cans was fun. I still need to grind it super much because there is. Uh, oh, wow. Damn. I'm leveling up. Hobo. Definer. Fulfill your request and read to the city of social ills. Uh, the quest might be anything uh, from taking down tag, blah blah blah. Okay, I think I already read it. Uh, Walkathon? What are those things? Trash Seeker. Here we go. I got this. Uh, and uh, Okay, let's check this out. Watch this. I got swing on this dude, I guess. I'm spreading to magic, guys. You want to fight? Let's go! Sojin on train? You're gonna be in a war with your life. I'm not sure. Okay. I okay, need to. Oh, yeah. Get you down. Her defense and renewing her in the staff. No, don't get caught. Let's go. 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 In case I didn't unlock this. We gotta fight some more? I'm in good shape. Oh, this is side quest. Right? Yeah. Oh well. Uh, I slept like a baby. Hmm? 
Nonsense moving, comforting low hum. Kicking back in a cold but comfy seat in complete and total darkness. Place is perfect when you need a nap. Yeah, I'll stop by again next time class is canceled. I don't remember anything about the movie, though. Well, that makes two of us. <laughs> <laughs> Vintage film theater. Guess they only show old movies here. Yeah. We're not an inn, you know. Have a little respect, huh? Uh, this is a classic, too. Okay. Something hey, Mister. Interested in watching a movie? We've got some classic uh, titles in house. Sure. No. Oh, well. Well, I also get kind of sleepy when I'm in the dark watching a movie I don't really understand. I don't want to be disrespectful. <laughs> it's quite all right. But just because a film is old doesn't mean it's hard to follow. Old films span a whole range of genres, from sci-fi to romance, suspenseful thrillers to fun for the whole family. And of course, we have many titles are just as spectacular as the latest and the greatest, guaranteed to keep you on the edge of your seat. Huh. These were long before CG, which means things like real explosions on the set doesn't get much better than that. In fact, I'll say it's downright fresh. So much so that I'm confident you'll feel refreshed by the time the credits roll. All right, I'll bite. You must really love movies. Your eyes light up whenever you talk about them. <laughs> well, I didn't choose to be a curator of vintage films for nothing. I simply want nothing more than for people of today to watch these films and find some joy, even if it's just a little. It'd be a waste if they were left to be forgotten. Wouldn't you agree? But then, I suppose that's entertainment, an ever-fleeting sparkle. Though it would be fantastic if people saw these films as a brilliant little sparkle in their own lives. I get you. So that's why you opened up the theater. Correct. The Seagull Cinema is a place where anyone of any age can come to appreciate the classics. Though anyone also includes those who fall asleep during the screening. <laughs> Regardless, this is a good opportunity for you to get a taste of the classics for yourself. And since it's your first time, this one's on the house. Oh, really? You sure? Quite. I'd like you to see all the good this place has to offer. Okay, a movie, uh, a free movie ain't bad. Maybe I'll give it a shot. Watch a movie. Well, I'm already here, so I might as well. Excellent. Right this way, please. Today's showing is a monumental piece. Robo Cook, half culinary drama, half gunslinging action masterpiece. I can watch this over and over again and never get tired of Robocop. it. Robocop. <laughs> Wait, you're gonna watch too? Of course. As a curator, I'm allowed to watch any film I want at any time I please. Oh. All right. I'm thinking this guy built this place just so he can sit around watching his favorite movies all day. I think that too. Well, it's about to start. No sleeping during the screening now. We must show our utmost respect for those who brought these splendid works to life. I dare say that even blinking would be a waste of precious screening time. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, so <clears throat> some kind of mini game, right? Oh shit. This place is weirdly comfy. Damn, now I'm sleepy as hell. That guy was nice enough to let me in here. Don't fall asleep. Oh, so I will need to not, not fall asleep. Yeah? Probably. Come on. What is it? What is it? What is it? I won't read it. Just enjoy subtitles. About a cyborg who comes to cook. Alright, I'll bite. Hopefully I can stay awake. 
Who's that? I'm sleepy all of a sudden. Catherine? What am I supposed to do? Uh, test your reflexes to by quickly pressing uh, the displayed inputs to stop from pesky ram rams. From putting Kasuga to sleep, you will win if Kasuga doesn't fall asleep by the end of the movie, which will surely make him a better man. Okay, so it's a uh, it's a uh, rhythm game. Uh, next. Uh, Defeat normal ram rams by pressing the displayed inputs. Chicken, rooster. Ram rams with a rapid can be defeated by pressing the input five times. Okay, alarm cocks. Yep, cocks. The chickens will heal you, but if you hit them, they will seek vengeance. If you press an impulse with no ram rams inside, you take damage. Oh, okay. Movie hit a movies hit a point where they get especially boring, giving uh, your false rush mode. Uh, golden ram rams will appear, who cause extra sleepness. Deal with them quickly. It's a written game. Uh, what's going on? Time until the movie ends. Kasuga's energy, the movie's name, current score. I want to know where the notes appear. Damn you. Uh, controls. Uh, ram the ram rams. Ram, okay. Uh, pause. Okay. So it's Persona dancing game. I already played the three of them, so. Shouldn't be that bad. supposed to do that. Yeah, I gotta sleep more. Okay. That's it? And fall asleep for once. Hisats, Yo Galaxy, Extreme Flambe. I know this is supposed to be an exciting scene, but I'm using the same technique over and over. Gonna, uh, he was uh, gonna put me to sleep. Okay. Shit, movies make me so sleepy. So this is the boring part of the movie, huh? Shit. Was awesome. Oh, it's just getting good. Konoaji, a 
温かい母さんの味思い出したぞこの隠し味は塩だ母さんの秘伝のレシピしかと受け継いだこれからも俺は料理に生きる He gets stronger by remembering his family. That's actually kind of touching. That was awesome. Okay, I need to redo it. I need to redo it uh, later. I, I press to cox. Ooh, at least I was able to stay awake. That was pretty good, though. Guess it doesn't matter how old it is. A good movie's a good movie. I probably would have gone my whole life without watching one of these if it wasn't for this place. This guy really wants everyone to enjoy the classics, huh? There's still a lot I haven't seen, so I should come take a breather when I have time. Thanks for today, Mr. Curate. <laughs> oh, sure. Respect the classics. Yeah, bullshit. Safe. Uh, the challenge is a quest that can Okay. 